Hey guys, Luke Zoggy here, and today I'm going to be breaking down the lunge for you and show you how to do it correctly. Uh, lunge is a lower body uh, movement, but uh, you're really working everything, your core while you're doing this, but great for building leg strength, uh, building muscle. You're going to be working your glutes, your hammies, your quads, and it's great for fat burning as well because there's such big muscles, you get your heart rate up while you're doing lunges, and they're actually really challenging. So. Good to know how to do them correctly with good form to prevent injury. So the best way to prevent injury by working out good form is uh, if you can do it in front of the mirror, do it in front of a mirror is great to watch what you're doing and see your cues and see where you can fix things or film yourself. There's no shame in filming yourself. I reckon I've learned so much from filming myself in workouts and watching the playback and being like, oh yeah, my hips or you know, something's a little bit out there. So film yourself. Watch it back and just, you know, tweak it. So let's break down the lunge, hey? So what we're gonna do first, you're gonna come with one foot forward. I'm gonna do my left foot. You don't wanna, you don't have to be too far forward. Just, you know, take a, a nice step out. Um, the, big, the big thing here is whatever foot you have for in front is gonna be taking the bulk of the weight. So 80% of the weight is gonna be on this left side. The back side's almost like taking 20% and helping to keep your balance. Uh, biggest thing will be here is you might lose your balance. So I'm gonna stare directly at the camera. I have got eyes on you to get my uh, my levels right, but stare on something at the ground, pick a spot, because that can uh, be challenging as well. Now, the cues are here, 80% of the weight is gonna be on this left heel, which is gonna fire this hamstring and glute. Um, you don't want your knee coming too far forward, like over your toes, and you're gonna come down to where you feel comfortable. Everyone's range is different, but you're gonna practice this and get better at it. So I keep my hands on my hips, all the weight's going into this side. I'm looking straight, I wanna keep my, my top of, you know, my upper body nice and neutral, head neutral, come down, driving the weight on that heel, fire that glute. I can feel that there, my bum is tight, it's ready. So let's do another one. Coming down, everything's nice and neutral, drive up. That's due to, if that's too challenging, you can let this knee go to the ground softly. So what I mean by that is you're here, you set up, all the weights on this heel, slowly lower down, and you're here. Little breather, reset, stand tall. Again, everything straight, weights on this heel, this side's firing, come down and softly land on that side, stand up tall. Now, once you've mastered that, the next step up is to add weight to make it harder. What I would do is grab two dumbbells. Um, setup's the same, everything's the same. 80% of the weight's in that heel. But because you've got weight now, it's gonna naturally wanna come forward. So this is gonna challenge your core more. In this position, I say I've got two dumbbells, shoulders back, nice and neutral, chest up, standing here with weights, stand tall. Again, see a little bit unbalanced there. Look straight, weights on that side. Stand tall. And that is how you do a lunch.